Nutrients are essential. We need them to produce food. They provide energy and support the growth and maintenance of our bodies. Without adequate nutrients, people become malnourished and cannot protect themselves from disease. We get our nutrients from plants and animals through the food we eat. Animals get their nutrients from the plants they eat, and plants take nutrients from the soil and elements from the air. Plants require 17 essential nutrients. The primary nutrients are nitrogen, N, phosphorus, P, and potassium, K. Each nutrient does many things for the plant, but the basics are this. Nitrogen is often called the builder. It is necessary for chlorophyll synthesis, which helps the plant stay healthy, green, and strong. Nitrogen helps make plant proteins as well. Phosphorus is referred to as the enforcer. It helps the plant trap and use the sun's energy to make food through photosynthesis. Plants also need phosphorus to grow healthy root systems. Potassium is often called the protector. Potassium protects our plants against diseases and helps them stay healthy when it is cold or dry because it helps move nutrients and water in the plant to where it's needed most. We may not realize it, but the soil beneath our feet is a vibrant source of life and nutrients. Soil is home to lots of living and non-living materials. This includes rocks, minerals, bacteria, and countless insects and organisms so small you need a microscope to see them. It takes a long time to make soil. As rock crumbles and erodes, the minerals mix with the organic material from the remains of plants and animals that decay over time, creating nutrient-rich soil. Soils are like a bank where nutrients and water are stored. Plants get the nutrients they need from the soil through their roots. If these nutrients are not replaced through the use of fertilizer and organic material, the bank is depleted and the soil will slowly become less fertile. <laughs> Nutrient deficient plants show symptoms like turning pale yellow in color and have poor growth. They're less able to compete with weeds, resist plant diseases, insects, or drought. These plant health related problems may result in less food grown with lower nutritional value. Let me tell you about best management practices. Developed from science and experience, they're used to prevent soil depletion, improve production on current land, and make sure farmers aren't forced to move onto new fertile land elsewhere. As a result, more natural habitat is preserved. Best management practices range from simple planting of shelter belts or hedge trees to reduce soil erosion to more technical practices like the use of global positioning systems for the precise application of nutrients. Best management practices will be different depending on where you farm, but each practice allows farmers to do more with less. To maximize sustainability, farmers use best management practices such as the 4R Nutrient Stewardship System. First, farmers test the soil to find out what nutrients the soil needs, and then they select the seeds that will grow best in the area. Next, they can use the 4R Nutrient Stewardship System to precisely apply the nutrients required to grow a healthy crop. Farmers start with the right source to determine the correct combination of nutrients, then they figure out the exact amount the plant needs. This is the right rate, not too much and not too little. The nutrients must then be applied at the right time of year and the right place in the field to increase crop uptake. Take a look at how the 4R nutrient stewardship system can help farm families. For example, in Kenya, farmers carefully apply fertilizers, plant material, or manure near the plant's roots using the 4Rs. Here the nutrients are being applied on the surface, so they are at risk of being lost to the environment. Too many losses can cause negative impacts on the air, water quality, and habitats. In the long run, it's not sustainable. That's why best management practices like the creation of riparian areas and the use of the 4R nutrient stewardship system are so important. They can improve crop yields, increase soil quality, increase farm profits, and protect habitats you will have the opportunity to help your farm families use best management practices to improve sustainability. Remember the sustainability barrel. Be thoughtful with your choices. And always keep in mind that every decision has more than one impact on sustainability.